Hi everybody, Jeremy here from Video Editor Studio and today I'm gonna share with you how to create a DRFX file to install your titles in DaVinci Resolve 17. Let's check it out. All right, so I'm gonna show you basically how to create a DRFX file so you are able to install your titles, transition and effect uh, in DaVinci Resolve 17.2 and above. Cause now the way to install um, titles has changed a little bit and I had a bunch of question on how to create that DRFX file. I'll show already how to install it. I'll link uh, that to the description below, but here I'm gonna talk about how to create it. So you will still need to have the dot setting file if you're already familiar with DaVinci Resolve. When you export a title it gives you a dot setting file um, it still need that obviously it's just the packaging that is changing the cool way about using a drfx file is that now we can add thumbnail to it by creating a png that got the exact same name as your file so here i have a png starter pack check under parenthesis ves and down there my first file is starter pack check under parenthesis ves by having the exact same name both for the file and for the png it's gonna just automatically create a thumbnail when i'm gonna install the drfx and here as you can see I have already this pack installed, uh, you have the thumbnail right here, which is very, very convenient so you can quickly overview uh, what you're trying to use when you're editing. So how are we gonna create that DRFX? So it's gonna be very simple. It's basically, we are creating a package um, to help DaVinci um, paste those in the right folder automatically for us. Uh, so basically, we're gonna create the folder structure that usually we had to follow to go and paste the dot setting file. So usually we're just gonna uh, copy and paste that dot setting file in the right folder. I have a shortcut basically to go there in my favorite, but basically you have to go to the DaVinci Resolve folder and then uh, you have to go over to Fusion, Templates, uh, here you go either to Fusion or to Edit, and then you install uh, your title right here. So basically what we're we doing now, um, the creating the DRFX file is gonna automatically uh, put us into template uh, and then we just helping DaVinci to understand if we need to go in FX, Generator, Title, Transition, or Infusion. So basically you're creating those folder for it and then you're creating a package um, by creating a zip file that we converted then to DRFX. It sounds way more complicated than it is. Um, so basically you create those exact folder. The name needs to be exactly the same as those folder. Otherwise uh, it will run into some error. So basically you create the edit, you create the fusion folder, uh, you create uh, your effect generator title transition and then you're just gonna come and paste your setting files and your png uh, make sure that it's dot png and not dot jpeg because it will not work with the dot jpeg uh, if you want to create any thumbnail uh, and you don't have to have the thumbnail you can also just drop the file uh, it's just a new option that now you can use the thumbnail but you don't have to it's not an obligation once you've done that for the edit page you can do exactly the same for uh, fusion if you want to have those assets also available in the fusion page you can create the dedicated folder and paste all your asset here and it will install it automatically in fusion once all that is done you want to zip that folder but be careful don't zip this folder right here everything is contained in this starter pack vos uh, if i try to right now compress and basically create a zip file with this folder it will not work it will give me an error message because uh, there is an extra step uh, which is the name of this folder. What we want, I'm gonna delete this one. What we want, it want to create a folder with those two. So we're gonna select those two and then we're gonna hit compress. Here we're creating basically the zip file and this, this zip file that we're gonna convert to TRFX. To do that, we're just gonna rename it. Here I'm gonna do, go with starter pack VES. And then the zip, we're gonna change it for DRFX. So essentially, it's a zip file uh, that is converted to the DaVinci format. And here, we're just gonna convert to that. And here, as you can see, the icon is changing and we have now our DRFX file. Uh, so it's very, very simple. There is nothing complicated about it. And now to install it, uh, it's pretty straightforward. Again, you can just double click on it and then it's just gonna open the window. And here, as you can see, I already have it uh, installed on my Mac. Uh, I can overwrite it, uh, but basically that's not gonna do anything. So now if I'm going to template, show folder, as you can see here in template, instead of going directly here and install um, it right here in title effect transition, it's now as a bundle uh, right there. 
and it's easier to manage because before you used to add a bunch of titles here and everything was mixed and it was very hard to find a specific title now you have everything just uh, created as a bundle and it make it way easier to manage let me know if you have any other question i'll be happy to try to reply i hope this video was clear and concise don't forget to like and subscribe and see you in the next one bye speed up your workflow and create better videos using the pack available on our website including titles transition and templates but only for davinci resolve get started today by downloading our free starter pack containing a compilation of 20 titles created from our library. Link in the description below or at videodigastudio.com.